morning everybody. I have got my cereal, I've got my laptop, I'm just editing. Nanny and Atticus are playing and it's a beautiful morning and a beautiful view to wake up to. I wish I could edit like this every morning. I'd be so much more productive than I am at home. I am now ready for the day. I don't know if you guys can actually see but I drew on some mini freckles. I always wanted like freckles but I just don't really have them. I more just have blemishes. So I thought you know what I'm going to draw them on. I just used a angled brush and some Benefit browsings and it was my mum's browsings. I just dotted some on my nose. I haven't done many but you should be able to see them and I just thought it kind of like tied my makeup look together. Um, I also get a lot of questions on what my highlight is. It's the Ofra X Nikki Tutorials collab and the Sof Des Nails X Makeup Revolution collab. As you can see YouTube is collabs with the best highlighters. So I am ready. Today I've just straightened my hair out even though it will probably end up going up because we're going on the beach and I've just done quite like not natural makeup but like not really natural glam either i don't know but this is my makeup and then i've got on my necklace from pretty little thing which i love and then i've got on a dress from pretty little thing which i'll show you in the mirror sorry it's quite dark but this is my dress you can see my bra a little bit but that's kind of normal i couldn't really cover it up um and then i've got on my cycle shorts underneath so you can't see my knickers behind but yeah i really like this dress it's like a nudie color and i thought it was really pretty and it just says pretty little thing and it's like a ribbed material and i never normally wear dresses so i thought this would be quite nice to wear just for the beach and I'm gonna wear with it. Let me just grab them. I think they're up here behind them. No, they're not. Where did I put them then? Okay, that's really strange. Let me just stand on the bed. Oh no, I did put them up here. They're under my bra. I'm just gonna take my Primark flip flops because it's so annoying when you get sand in your trainers. So I just thought, you know what? I might as well buy these. They're only 90p as well. So these are the shoes that I'm gonna wear. Ada. What? I really need to get back to work. What are you do? What are you working as? Oh, are you being the cleaner? I be no, I be. I can't do it to do too much work. <coughs> oh, you don't want the cleaner to do too much work, so you want to help him? No, I, I just gotta clean. I have to clean him things he don't do. Okay, Atticus. <laughs> So just a little quick story time this morning. So basically it was like nine o'clock. I was just getting ready. We were all getting ready. And we just hear this knock at the door. And it was like a very formal knock. It was like a, it was literally that. And we heard it, we were like, oh, it's the cleaners. Gosh, that's like really early. Um, so we were like, okay, we'll leave it a second. Then we're about to go to the door. And then we get that knock again. And then there's a man standing at the door and he just goes, Julie Stanton. And my mum's like, yeah like what on earth like it sounded so formal like it was scary and um, then he went um oh what did he say he just looked at her for a minute and was like is everything okay and then he was like we've received a complaint and we were like what like we haven't done anything um and they were like we've received a complaint that you've been stomping around the whole night and you've been creating like loads of noise but he actually used those words like he said you've been stomping around um all through the night and my mum looked at him and we were like what like no we haven't like we were asleep by like midnight the very latest Atticus was asleep by 10 and then me and my mum and my nan were just watching tv we were like absolutely not that definitely isn't us they were like no Judy Santon it was you we were like what we haven't done anything so whoever decided to report us thank you so much for that we think it was the people underneath us even though we don't even know if there's anybody underneath us so it must be the people next door we were like do we say anything do we ask them what we did we were like we don't really know how to address it but we were just kind of annoyed because we hadn't done anything like we definitely hadn't made any noise so that's the story time i guess we'll see if we get another complaint tonight even though we haven't been making any noise so i will keep you guys updated with that one but today we are heading off to the beach like i said i'm very excited nanny you excited yeah i'm really excited i think it was the ghost last night anna what well, making all the noise <laughs> nanny's just making some what do you call them again the paper christmas trees for atticus look i've cut them out oh yeah she's making noise. She's making paper little trees for Attica. So then she's got her new watermelon top on, which looks really pretty. We've made it down to the beach and the temperature is beautiful. And I've got a Lunchable to have. It's so, so nice. The sea is really far away. Yeah, it's so warm, isn't it? It's really warm on your face. It's so nice. I've literally just got all my legs in the sand. And it's so, so beautiful. The weather is perfect today. Like it's not too hot and it's not too cold. How are you ready? Oh. Oh, Attica. Oh, that was close. Go on then, mum. Go on. Oh. oh. Well, who's was the closest? Um, the Atticus's was pretty close. Who's is the orange one? I don't remember what colour mine was. It wasn't blue or red. Mine was orange. Quite close. Me and oh, me and Mum were we're close, Atticus. Right, on then, Mum. Who will have to go? Give it to Anna, Atticus. Right. Passing on Atticus. Thank you. Who's, who's going first? Go? Oh, oh, that was close. Nanny, you'll go. Try again. Yeah. Oh, good oh, boy! <laughs> he cheats. Go on, Anna. Oh, Anna! Did it! Right, and you got it on 
on camera. <laughs> Oh, that was close, Sunny. That was really good. Anna and Daddy just won. No, Daddy can do it again. Daddy can do it again. Oh. No, Anna and Anna. Anna and Anna. We have been chilling on the beach for the past two or three hours and I cannot even tell you how nice it is. I have to put my jacket on because I'm feeling the cold a little bit now, but honestly, this is genuinely one of the nicest British beaches I've ever been no. on. It's so, so nice. Atticus is all those covering us all in sand and we've built like a massive, like basically Atticus loves to be in the beach, so we built like a beast castle slash trench thing I'll show you. He's over there. He's got like the beast castle, which is just there. And he's got the stick, which is the sword. And Atticus, are you Gaston? Yeah. Yeah, and he's in, and he's caught in the trap. And a sand. We've come into the Skyline Pavilion, and I've got a pancake for like my snack slash lunch. Basically, we're just going off the rails with the food this weekend. I mean, it looks so good. I've got Nutella, strawberries, and a pancake. And we're just waiting for the Teletubbies to come on. And Atticus is dressed up as Fireman Sam. And we'll put another pound in. Throw back to the moshy days when I absolutely used to be crazed over it. I'm so tempted to try and win this. I've got some two peas. There's a fridge magnet and a ruler. Oh, she's a shape shifter. Oh, don't know how much footage I got yesterday. I know we had this hilarious like goggle box type situation going on where we were telling my nan about the theory that David Icke came up with about the uh, royals being shape-shifting lizards in a celebration of the royal wedding. Nan was not having any of it, although I can't I don't necessarily believe they're lizards, but I do believe that there's something going on. Hey. What, you want to do a song again? Yeah. Oh, go on then. <laughs> he loves his songs, doesn't he? What one do you want to sing? Which one should we sing? Oh, I think we should sing the Gaston one. Yes. So it's time to follow me. There you go. Who's with me? I am. <gasps> Atticus, mummy, stop the beast. So what are we doing today? Where are we going now? We are going. We're going to wonder. We're going to go to the tent. We're going to get some food. And I'm going to take this. And you're going to take that because that's your sword, isn't it? <laughs> One, two, three. Oh, 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 look at it. Oh, yeah. Oh, and a video is. There she is. Oh, oh. Gaston. He's so chuffed, isn't he? Yeah, yeah he loves that. <laughs> that good? 
Atticus. Oh, oh, don't know why. Me and Atticus are in this little orb thingy and we're about to go up to like the top of the skyline. I think we're not the top, but like near enough the top. Are you excited, Atticus? He wants me to cuddle him, but he's really scared. Is it ready? Oh, wait, hang on. Is it ready? Yeah. Oh, I can't hear it. Ready? Ready to We're on our way up. Look, is everybody getting look? Look at mummy and nanny, look, nanny's waving us off. Look, we're going up high, Atticus. Look, there's mummy down there. Oh, Atticus. You can't see them down. I can't see them anymore, we're up high. You can't see them down. Do you like it? Yeah. Okay, we're having a bit of an issue. We think we're stuck because they're not actually moving anymore. So, and we've been up here for like a minute or so, so. Mum and Nan, look, through this little gap down here and trying to get us out. Look at them! Oh, no, we're coming, we're coming, we're coming. Oh, we're coming now. There we go. Look, we're on our way down. <laughs> that was funny, wasn't it? Yeah. I just took Atticus into the gift shop and I tried him to some Sprout stuff that he really wanted because Sprout was his favourite character. And I also got him the dressing up outfit he's about to put on over his outfit and then I'll show you it. Oh, look at it. Oh, Atticus. Oh, Atticus, you look so good. It's good enough. Are they meant to be jack up now? Yeah, they're meant to be jack up. What, are they got one? Yeah. Which one is it? It's Sprout. The green one, Sprout. I have now just finished getting ready for dinner. I've just topped up my makeup. I literally took my red lip off earlier. Did I even show you guys my red lip? Yeah, I did show you guys my red lip, right? I had a red lip on and I really liked it, but then it all kind of went crusty around the edges. So I've just popped a nude on top, but the red kind of seeps through it a little bit. Um, but as I said, we're about to go for dinner. We don't actually know where we're going for dinner yet. There's several restaurants on site, uh, but I'm not even that hungry. Like I'm not gonna lie, I've eaten so much over the past few days that now we're going for dinner. I just don't even want to eat. And I never thought I'd say that. I kind of want to go to like a buffet, like self-service type restaurant. Cause then I can kind of just get the portion that I want. Um, um, but yeah, I will let you guys know where we go. But I've got this. Well, actually, no, I've changed outfits. I've got on this grey top. I've got on a white blazer. And then I've got on the same trousers. And now we're going to go for dinner. I just really wish I was hungry. And I'm just really, really not. It's a lie. I'm hungry for more dessert things than actual food. <laughs> Mum, rate your meal out of 10. Oh, my God. <laughs> Starters, I had, um, I had leek and potato soup with a bread roll. That was like so nice, homemade. Then I had steak and mushroom pie, homemade, with a mountain of mash and runner beans and gravy. Amazing. Mountain of mash. It, your mountain of mash getting your. And now lemon cheese cake and cream. Oh, yeah. <laughs> What did you have, Nanny? Um, so uh, okay. right, that was mine now. That was mine now. We'd have left it. Then you had. And then I had the roast, but to be honest, I had too much. I was only eat half of it, which is not good for me. Um, then I had ice cream and it was bad. It was really nice, wasn't it? I have to tell the camera. I'll give it definitely a nine. Oh yeah, Dan's giving no, it a nine. I gave it a ten. I'd give it a ten. Yeah. Atticus, how good was Atticus, your meal? Atticus, tell the camera what you had for dinner. What did you have? You had yeah, some tomatoes. You had lots of uh, rice. Chippies. Chippies and rice. And rice. A roll. A roll and ice and cream. Some ice cream. <laughs> How many would you he give it is out a man of very How many would you say out of ten? How many would you give it out of ten? A high school or a low school? Yeah, all good boy. So how many do you think? You have to say out of ten, so what do you think? A, a nine or a ten, should we say? Eleven. Eleven. That's amazing. Oh, that's amazing. Oh, that yours was above the ordinary, weren't it? Yeah. Mm. Oh, oh, a twelve. Go on then.